Hundreds of Irish Republicans and Loyalists are to take to the streets of Glasgow this weekend for St. Patrick's Day celebrations. Three separate events are taking place in the city to mark the occasion on Saturday, with upwards of 360 people set to take part. It comes despite parades across Ireland being cancelled over fears of the coronavirus. Taoiseach, Irish PM, Leo Varadkar announced all parades and festivals in the Republic of Ireland would not go ahead including the celebrations in Dublin. The parade will leave Blithswood Square at 11.30 a.m. sharp, heading through the city centre and finishing at Barrowland Park with the party continuing in Bar 67 afterwards. They ask that everyone attending make it as colourful as possible, Ireland, pig.twitter.com slash And Belfast's Mayor Daniel Baker confirmed their event would not go ahead. He said, the decision has been taken as a precaution given members and the public's concern around coronavirus. Our St. Patrick's Day celebrations are always hugely anticipated so it's very disappointing that this year's event won't go ahead as planned. The first of the events in Glasgow, run by a Republican group called Janaharian, starts at Blithswood Square at around 11.30am. The march, which organisers have estimated will bring in 200 participants, will make its way through the city heading east before finishing in Barrowland Park. The group will then gather in Bar 67 afterwards. At the same time, the James Connolly Republican Flute Band are also holding an event. They expect 100 people to join them at Elder Street in Govan. Members of Belfast City Council have tonight taken a precautionary decision to postpone this year's St. Patrick's Day Parade and Concert hashtag Belfast SD Pats. A notice of their march says that after negotiation and agreement their start time was amended to 11.30 a.m. They will march through the area along streets including Govan Road, Broomalone Road, Summerton Road and Langlands Road before finishing up at Craigton Road. Later, the Thornia Lee Bank and Pollock Shores Loyal Orange Lodge 28 are holding their St. Patrick's Day Parade. They're expecting around 60 participants, who are set to set together on Spires Bridge Avenue in Thornley Bank at 4.15pm. It comes after a Republican Bloody Sunday march was disrupted by far-right protesters in Glasgow city centre with fights breaking out back in January. Back in September a police officer was injured by a firework after protests against two Republican marches, by Corgin Arheyan and Erpwa Scotland, led to ten people arrested. This was despite a huge police operation, which reportedly cost hundreds of thousands of pounds, with officers in riot gear chasing masked loyalists trying to stop the parades. That came following tensions at the end of August as riot like s for more on this story, visit the news article link.